Hey, good morning. This is Kiki. I'm just getting off of work. Um, Simply Key or whatever you want to call me. I'm pretty much... Well, I hope I'm in the right lane. I'm trying to do this vlog thing like everybody else does. And I don't know how they do it in their car. I don't even know where to look. Look right here? I look right there. Either way, I guess I look right there. Um, but I just got off of work. It was, it was interesting, I must say. It was a good night. Busy, steady. Um, and just, you know, I really don't personally like talking about work, uh, to tell you the truth, but it just seems like over these past couple of months, I almost want to cry that my purpose for being a nurse is coming back. Because I'm not going to lie, I've been a nurse for over 10 years. For 10 years. And I, I felt like I'm burnt out. Everything, you know, the C word happened. And um, family and everything like that. And I'm, I'm not going to lie. I, it felt like pur purposeless. I'm like, I don't know what I want to do. And um, I got fired. <laughs> Y'all ever want to hear my story about being fired? Never got fired in my life. Got fired. If you want to hear that story, let me know. Um, but I really didn't, I didn't even care. That's how bad it was. But it just seems like today, especially after the shift, purpose, that purpose has for the reason why I'm here, the reason why I'm called to this profession. I became a nurse for money. Nursing is not my first career. It's not my first degree. And all I want to do is be a travel nurse or whatnot. I've never been a travel nurse yet. And so, but, ner but my purpose, my calling has allowed me to stay for over 10 years and these past, I will say from 2017 truthfully 2018 to 2020 for the past two years I just I just been going to work but it just felt purposeless I'm not saying I didn't have days where um where it wasn't it didn't feel good but um I just really thank God. I 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 thank God that, you know, that my purpose has been rediscovered, you know, that I felt like I'm called to do this. Wherever it may be, I'm called to do this. And uh, I just appreciate God. So I'm just on my way home. I do work again tonight. And I hope you guys can hear me. Um, I am starting this channel again. I, I say again because I've tried. And, um, and here we go. <laughs> so, um, I'm, I've, I've, I've really tried to avoid, to tell you the truth, having a YouTube channel about nursing. I really did because I'm like, I'm stressed about work. I don't want to talk about work. But it's just today, I'm not going to say this whole channel is going to be always about nursing. But today I'm like excited to be a nurse. Grateful to be a nurse. And I guess that's my takeaway. This video is not going to be too long. But my takeaway is grateful, thankful, and blessed. Grateful, thankful, and blessed. And I'm I'm not saying I'm better than anyone else. I could be there receiving care. You could be there receiving care. But I'm grateful, I'm thankful, I'm blessed that I'm rendering care. And trying to be a blessing. And trying to make whomever is on the other end comfortable. And their families, you know, through this these trying times, uncertain times, 
Uh, I mean, the world alone is uncertain, and then you're you're here in a sick bed, and so that's it. That's it. Um, I do want to end in prayer because that's just who I am. Um, not perfect, <laughs> but but uh, I thank God so. In Jesus' name, I just want to say thank you, Lord. Thank you for waking us up this morning. Thank you for giving us life. Thank you for giving us strength, oh God. Forgive us for being ungrateful. Forgive us for being selfish. Forgive us for taking this field for granted. Um, taking our jobs, our prospective jobs for granted. Taking our positions as, as, our, as children are taking our positions as aunties, are taking our position as nurses, taking our position as wives and, and mothers and fathers for granted and not being appreciative of the position you have put placed us in for such a time as this. For such a time as this. Lord, we're grateful. We're thankful. And I just pray, Lord, that you may be with each and every one of us I pray, Lord, for those celebrities, families that are mourning the loss of their loved ones that we all came to love and know. But I'm praying for that little lady that is nameless, that we don't know about, and her family is also grieving. I'm praying for the young couple who is just recently married, and the doctors have no idea what's going on, but I thank God that we have a great physician that does know. I thank you, O oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus for complete healing for those who are in need, restoration for those whose minds aren't right, peace and joy for those who, who are needing it. And in all this, O oh God. Okay, I'm back. Uh, had a little tough technical difficulties. Stop by my favorite. You got me. Ice coffee. I'm addicted. Lord, bless me. Lord, pray for me. I hate McDonald's coffee. But they ice coffee off the chain. We're going to start the challenge next week. Maybe next week after. Getting fit. Amen. But um, anyway, you guys. Technical difficulties. Ending it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Y'all have a blessed day. Have a blessed day. Um. And I'll see y'all next time.